Fans of Stranger Things have witnessed numerous tragic deaths after the show's first four seasons. Eddie Munson is beyond limits even to discussion. We haven't moved past it yet. But did you know that some of your favorite characters from Stranger Things were originally intended to pass away? That is real. These people weren't intended to still be alive by season 4. Eleven was not expected to survive season 1 of Stranger Things. Without Millie Bobby Brown's Eleven, Stranger Things would be impossible to imagine. She serves as the focus of the entire series. The show's creators, Ross and Matt Duffer, have acknowledged that Eleven was initially intended to pass away at the conclusion of season 1. Speaking to Gina McIntyre in her book, Worlds Turned Upside Down, Ross Duffer revealed Eleven was going to sacrifice herself to save the day. That was always the end game. But once we realized that the show was potentially going to go on longer than one season, we needed to leave it more up in the air because deep down we knew the show just wouldn't really work without Eleven. And at that point, we knew how special Millie was. If there was going to be more Stranger Things, Eleven had to come back. Hi. Steve Harrington almost became Demogorgon food, Steve, played by Joe Keery, quickly became a fan favorite in Stranger Things season 1, but that wasn't always the plan. In fact, the Duffers originally wrote the character as more of a Billy Hargrove type of character. However, Keery won the Duffers over. When he comes back and fights the Demogorgon, that was supposed to be Jonathan's dad, Matt Duffer revealed to Rotten Tomatoes. Duffer also revealed that Steve was supposed to die in season 1. Listen, if things here start to go south, I mean at all, you abort. The Duffers didn't originally plan for Stranger Things season 4 to end with Max Mayfield in a coma, easily one of the most heartbreaking scenes in Stranger Things season 4 featured Max, Sadie Sink, essentially dying in Lucas Sinclair's arms. She technically did when she stopped breathing for a few minutes, but Eleven revived her. In the Stranger Things after show, Ross Duffer explained, it was discussed as a possibility. For a while, that is what was going to happen. But we ended up in this, we wanted to end it with a little more of a question at the end of the season. It's still really dark, and if Max is going to be okay, we just don't really know. We wanted to leave it up in the air moving forward into season 5. You can't. He'll kill you. I survived before. Chief Jim Hopper's prison buddy Dimitri died in at least one version of Stranger Things Season 4. Season 4 introduced fans to several new characters, including Eddie, Argyle, Eduardo Franco, and Dimitri, Tom Lachey. The Duffers confessed they originally planned for more characters to die in the latest season, but not all of it made it to the screen. Matt Duffer told Steve Weintraub with Collider, in terms of who makes it, who lives or dies. I think there was a version where Dimitri, aka Enzo, didn't make it. Although fans didn't see Yuri, Nicola Jericho, and Dimitri at the end of the finale in Stranger Things season 4, the episode implied they survived. That makes us wonder whether or not the two men might play a part in the final season. Unfortunately, we all have a couple of years until we find out. But he's still alive.